Hey guys, this is Red Frost, and welcome again to the Warlords of Draenor Beta. Last time, we finished off Thunder's Fall and checked out a couple of things within the uh, garrison. Today, we're gonna check up on our inn and going to finish up with the Battle of Thunder Pass, which is the last main quest line for the fro for the um, Frostfire Ridge starting area for Horde. So, before we move on, let's check on our tavern. So, let's see here. It must have fit Ah, there we go. It just finished installing. And apparently the peons are deep into their work inside the structure of the building. Okay, <laughs> whatever works. So let me sign on the deed and... We got a tavern. Oh. Hey! Guys, look, it's Lunk. And it's Bud. Holy crap. You know, it actually looks less... Sorry. Le I can't get closer. Come on. Let me... Bud! Hey there. Ah, they didn't give him the stupid... Uh, the, the stupid uh, voice that he used to have. Oh, well. But... See you later. It's Bud, and here's Lunk. Sadly, he doesn't have a voice. So collect the ogre family tree from the blood mold slag mine. So yeah, what the description said about this is completely true. Look, Tar. Can you sell me anything? A meat cleaver. Okay, so what does this do? Pretty much nothing. And I require higher cooking skill to use it? That's ridiculous. Oh, well. Go forth to victory. Again, beta is beta, so that might actually change. Who are you? A uh, headhunter. Don't be shy. Yeah, be needing someone for a job. I'll find you too. All right. Bye bye now. So that's about it. So there's a chest, a book, a uh, quiver. Quiver. Why did I say quiver? I meant a quill. And then there's this chick over here. Zug Zug. She's a bartender, but she's not really tending to anything around here. So I guess that's fine. But yeah, this does offer you. Oh, would you look at that? I got a dance studio. <laughs> I'll check up on that in a bit. So yeah, you get dungeon quests, you complete the dungeon quests, and you get, what was it, resources? Oh, mingled treasures. You need something? Mysterious treasures, so it could be gear, it could around. be resources, who knows? I'll have to check this out, get the quest, go into dungeons and see what I can find. But for the time being, this is the level one in. And hopefully I'll be able to level this one up and get lots more stuff for my garrison. So let's see what's up with the dance studio. Now as far as I know, in this latest build of the beta, they haven't actually made any changes to... Yes, yes. Johnny Castle's dead. Give me the thing. Yep. Oh, wait a minute. I thought I had this on a different character. Well, that's sad. And now I have two of these and I, <laughs> and I can't use them for anything. Well, that was smart of me. Is there any other quest here that might actually be kind of good? Oh, this one gives me a lot of money. Three followers. Oh, crap. This is going to be... Okay. Olin. Kala. And Olna. 54% chance of completing. Yeah, it's not gonna happen. Anything else? This is a three follower mission. Olin, Kala, and uh, Olna. 97% chance. 1000 XP plus, plus 1000 XP to all my followers. So, sure, why not? Ooh, damn. Cost 20 resources. Uh, screw it. They need the XP. So, while they're off. Do I have any more? No, I'll have to wait a few hours. So with that done, let's see if we can move on to the next phase 
in the quest line, so I've spoken to Durotan and he wants me to kill the Iron Wolf. So let's not disappoint him and head on over to the home of the Thunderlords, this carcass here, Grumgar. And let us get the Iron Wolf. Off we go. Okay, now before we get to the... Oh, crap, what's that? Hello! I can kill you, can I? Oh, wow! Oh, 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 oh! Huh, for some reason that looked like it might have hurt more than it actually did. What'd you give me? What'd you give me? Okay, so we got a cold... To oh, that's actually a piece of gear? Wow, that looks nice for transmog. I might actually keep that for my tanking set. Your attacks have a chance to trigger frost damage attack dealing. That's nice. That's really nice. So I got that. I got 16 resources and a mangy pelt. Wait, can I skin him? No, I can't. And that thing doesn't look nice. So anyway, I saw this while heading over to, uh, what was it again? Gromgar? And it's basically a garrison quest. Now, if you recall, I just spent, what was it, 20 resources uh, sending these guys on that particular mission. I can already get it back. All I gotta do is get some of these plants, send them over to my garrison, and gain some resources out of it. Oh, crap. There it is again. Yeah, that's it. Yep. Mess him up. Now, here's the odd thing. Oh, wait. Why is he... Oh! Okay. I think, since I already killed the rare, it's not showing up as rare for me anymore. Interesting. Really interesting. It's so, basically, that... Uh, demotivates anyone that might actually want. Oh, crap. Let go! Stupid whatever the hell you are. Okay, so basically that demotivates anyone from actually trying to. Oh, that's interesting. He's glowing, so anything I can use for professions has an outline as well again. Okay, why am I lagged? This just started happening. Okay, there it goes, but I'm still very freaking lagged. This is not good. Oh, darn. This is really not good. Well, let me just finish what I was saying. So, by not showing the mob as being a rare, it demotivates anyone from actually trying to kill it again. That being the case, you can actually let other people kill it instead. Okay, I think the lag's starting to get better, even though this thing doesn't tell me so. Huh. Something must be downloading in the in the background I haven't noticed. Who knows? So yeah, but again, I wouldn't have found that had I not gone out to explore and see what's going on. So, here I go. And Gromgar should be... Let's see. Actually, let me untrack this so I can... Yeah, there we go. It should be over this ridge. There it is! Alright, so let's see if we can k take care of that Iron Wolf. Here's uh, Durotan and Gnar and some shamans and frost wolves. So Thrall's not here? Iron Wolf, indeed. A coward hiding behind his minions. Oh, snap. Not for long. Oh, boy. Here we go. <laughs> oh, 
today. Must be ready. Okay. We'll be ready. The horn Heaven has imported the back here. Are you okay, husband? No. Our spirit will try on ever be okay with this. He right. made his choice. Come to Thunder Pass! We are outnumbered. Fifty to one. They don't stand. <laughs> All right. This land is nothing. Like Thank Azeroth. you for protecting my family, Red Tar. No problem, Thrall. I'm gonna take this for transmog. To Thunder Pass. There is no time to mourn our fallen or lick our wounds. Your scouts have already reported the sighting of a massive Iron Horde army making its way through Thunder Pass. I advise you let your garrison forces secure this area while you and I make our make for the pass east of here with the rest of the frost wolves it's time to show this iron horde what a united frost wolf clan can do so i need to speak to lokra at wolf stand for the horde all right so let's head on over there can i mount up yet no not yet oh boy And now, prepare yourselves for... <laughs> oh, so many dead. Oh, boy. Oh, I can skin this one. Gimme. Whee! Now, I need to go to Wolf Stand, so that's actually up there somewhere. So let's go this way. Oh, let's go this way. There we go. And get over there. Prepare for one epic battle. Interesting that I would pass through this area and suddenly I find this. An Iron Horde caravan. I'll think I'll claim this for myself. Ha! Hardly a challenge. 
So let's see, what do we have? What do we have? What's this? 38 garrison resources, guys. <laughs> As I told you earlier, you can find these everywhere. You just need to explore, get out there. Who knows, these might actually be scripted, these might actually be random, who knows. But in either case, if you really want your garrison to grow quickly, explore, go around, do random quests. You never know what you might be able to find. So anyway, here we are at Thunder Pass, or well, the Wolf Stand. Let's get the flight path. And oh, there's Lokra. There's apparently another Horde player here. Closer. I am here. I'm glad to see you. Our clan has faced many challenges, but the sheer size of the army coming towards us is beyond anything we have attempted to face. We need your experience. The Iron Horde has an army tenfold our number marching down the Thunder Pass as we speak. Durotan is am amassing our forces at the mouth of the pass. He is doing what he can to mount a defense, but war on this scale is not what the Frost Wolves are masters of. We will need your expertise. Please, go to him. We fight together. Right, so over there we go. This is gonna be big and amazing. I don't know if this is phased for everyone or if you can actually do this in a group. But sure to try. So here are our forces. In family, there is power. So, if the Thunder Lords are to be believed, then the Iron Horde is on its way. It falls on us to prevent them from taking Frostfire Ridge by force. We should move forward and defend our homeland at once. Let's move forward. Frost Wolves! The Iron Horde is coming. As we speak, they march on Thunder Pass. But the Frost Wolf clan is reunited. Together, we can protect this land. Lok Narosh, Frost Wolves, prepare for battle. And off we go. They'll take that flank, they'll take that flank. Here's Karg. Where's Drekthar? We will hold the line here. Oh, there he is. Drekthar, you can speak with the Earth. Do you think you can collapse this canyon? It would be a momentous task. I cannot make any promises. I can. Shaman, if you bring that cliff wall down, I promise that our enemy will be waiting right underneath it. Then I will do my best. You'd better hurry. Here they come. And so it begins. Now, Hold normally your position, I trust Frost Wolves. Let them come to you. As it was, as Duratan just said, I could charge forward and attack these guys. But following the storyline of this quest, I'd rather stay put and let them come to me. And besides, it makes the quest that much easier. Coming? For all? Ugh. I was taught by the best, Drekthar. You should tell your teacher to rely less on a hammer and more on his brains. <laughs> He'd be pleased to hear you say that. Oh. He's using his business, trying to punch me. Funny that I can make a tank bleed. Oh, moving away from the piston. Whoa, 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 whoa. 
Very simple fight indeed. Whoa, left piston. And down it goes. Back to the Frost Wolves. Come on, come on. My only complaint about this particular quest is that you almost want them to attack faster. This isn't a return point. It's a meat grinder. And yet they still keep coming. I know. That is the best part. <laughs> Okay, they're attacking Drekthar. In trouble. Kanar, get out there and lend him a hand. Hmm. Thought you'd never ask, brother. All I know is a wolf, and you go to the hero. Make sure my brother doesn't get himself killed. Yes, Durotan. I can still hear you! I'm out of I owe you my life. Save the Come at me. I smell thunder lords. Hold your ground. And don't stand in the bad stuff. What's interesting is the NPCs actually move away from the stuff. Very well done. this time. Get over here, you stupid overgrown elephant. Yeah, I won't kill it as fast as the Thunder Wolves, but I'd rather not have to skip all those spears again. Oh, lag, lag, what the hell? Okay, there we go. Come on, almost gotcha. And down it goes. <laughs> now this is a battle. Uh, who's this now? This one's mine. <laughs> I'll be waiting. Come, back me up, champion. I'm with you, Draka. Look at this cute little puppy you've sent me, Duratan. Does she know any tricks? Yes. 
a few. Ah, crap, I didn't move in time. I thought he'd be stunned. But apparently he's immune. If it make you happy, oh crap! Then let's play. Got distracted. Sorry. <laughs> well, that kind of sucked. Draka, come and join me in the Iron Horde. Lose that armor and settle down. Not this time. Mm, there we go. Almost done. All right, the final defense. Now you will notice that this is set up as a scenario, so it pretty much works the same way. Loktarogar Ganar. Well, they're not coming through here anytime soon. <sighs> okay, let's talk to Durotan. <laughs> oh, so many corpses! <laughs> nice! Welcome, friend of the Frost Wolves. This was a costly victory, and a very painful lesson. We chose to refuse the Iron Horde, 
and live as we always have, but I see now they will never respect such neutrality. I'm not about to wait for the Iron Horde to marshal their forces. We will fight with you and bring the Iron Horde to its knees. Commander, the Frost Wolves stand ready. Never leave. And there we go. You'll get cut up in the Frostfire. So that's the entire Frostfire Ridge quest line, or at least the main quest line. We've completed all the chapters, but as you can see, there's still more quests to do. And these bonus objectives that you can find throughout the map. So, again. Go ahead and explore Frost Frostfire Ridge. You're going to find lots of other things you could possibly do. Now, if you recall, last time we also got ourselves a quest to go to Gor uh, Gorgron. But before we do that, let's talk to Makar. Speak. The Frostfalls stand ready. Though we have lost much this day, the Frostfalls stand ready to uphold our pact with your people. To honor this agreement, some of my clan have asked to join your ranks and fight alongside your forces. Our numbers are strained, so I ask that you choose only one. Speak with me when you have made your decision. So I can either select Grandmother Greetings. Gaia, Calgor the Honorable, or Lokra. It is a good day to fight. As one. So let's see what they have to say. First, Lokra, since we already know her. Everybody pulls their weight. You've seen me at my worst, Retar. My husband taken from me, my wolf killed by the coward Fenris. I know intim intimately the price of war. We must bring the Iron Horde to an end. Grant me a place by your side on the battlefield, and I will bring the elements to bear to wreak vengeance on our enemies. You have only to accept my axe, and I will come. Now, she is a strong ally. For the clan. But to a certain extent, I feel that her place is with her family. We have Calgor, the Honorable. What is it? You have surpassed me on the battlefield more than once, and that's no simple feat. Still, there is much I can do that you've not yet seen. The spirits have not seen it fit to grant me their coldest, most harsh powers. The elements are my allies, and the bane of our enemies. It would be my honor to serve at your side. A strong shaman warrior. Run with the pack. I like. And of course, there's always Great Mother Gaia, which everyone remembers from the Burning Crusade. What do you need? I have lost two sons this day. I would see this war end before more brothers and sisters of the clans fall prey to the Iron Horde. My way is that of a healer. It is my gift to aid others injured by life or battle. If you will have me, I shall let my healing talents to your forces. Now, keep in mind, Go what we're on. choosing here is a garrison follower. So, I mean, as it stands, healer, DPS, or whatever, doesn't really account for all that much, unless you're really looking for a, dy a dynamic group for your garrison followers. Now, I like Lokra, but like I mentioned, I think her place is with her family. Calibor is definitely the warrior type, but I already have warriors in my garrison. Now, I could really use him because he has uh, attacks that can be used on multiple enemies, which can give us an edge in, uh, in the missions. But, considering that I'm going to be sending some of my followers into dungeons and into raids, they're going to need a healer. So, Great Mother Gaia? What can I do for you? I choose you. Go forth to victory. Speak. Excellent choice. I will be sad to see them leave, but I know they will help straighten our combined packs in the coming conflicts. I will see that they make their way to your garrison as soon as they have said farewell to their loved ones. They should be ready the next time you need to send followers on a mission. For the Frost so there we go. So she counters a magic debuff, increases success chance when on a mission with an undead, which I already have in my garrison, so that's good. And we basically just take it from there. 
So our next step at this point would be to visit Gorgron. But I'm not sure if I'm going to go ahead and do that just yet. Because we need to still see the Alliance side of things. So at least for the time being, this has been Frostfire Ridge. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. And, I mean, as always, like, comment, subscribe. And I hope to see you guys in the next video. Take care.